Okay, welcome back. So I'm pretty excited today. I know that this gun has been out for a long time. This is actually the second one that I've had of this model, albeit an earlier gen. But basically, today I have got the Glock 29 Gen 4, and this is going to be my new bicycle carry in the woods, my new hiking carry, my bear defense for the summer, and my EDC for the summer as well, for the most part. So let's get into it. I want to do an unboxing of this just because I'm excited. So here we go. When I open the box, you basically got the gun. You got three 10 round magazines. Now, um, these magazines, I've actually just filmed a video on changing out the base plates to add pinky extensions. So the gun does not come with these pinky extensions. It all the magazines look like this. So it came with three 10 round magazines. Uh, comes with four different back straps that you can add on to the gun here. Basically you just punch this little holding pin out and you can change it out. I have fairly small hands so for me I just keep the back strap the way it is with basically the most minimal back strap you can have. Uh, other people with bigger hands, they're going to want to perhaps change out to a thicker back strap. And what that does is it gives you more extension from the web of your palm to where you grip the trigger. And it's going to be uh, more comfortable for some people if they have a longer, a longer hand, bigger hand, obviously. So, but that's just for me. You got your basic uh, gun lock. You got a little cleaning tool attachment. Um, you've got your mag loader. Now, I don't really know anyone that actually uses these. I'll include a link. Um, I'm not sure if Amazon sells these or not, but I'll include a link below if they do. This is an Up Lula mag loader and basically this is what you want to get if you're going to be loading a bunch of magazines so i'll just demonstrate really quickly put this guy in here and basically what it does you gotta put it on a surface let me scoot it over here depress so it depresses the spring just slide the bullet in, makes it really quick and easy. Basically, you're just pinching, pulling down. Um, they also come with a little lock button. So if you want to lock it in place, let's see if I can do it. There we go. Um, it won't depress anymore. So anyway, that's just an aside. So. If you can at all avoid it, don't use the Glock loading tool. And, and then you just got the G29, which I'll do a proper review in the future. But as I referenced in another video, um, Alaskan Ballistics has done dedicated ballistics tests comparing the 29 to the 20 to the Glock 40. So the, all, the different lengths of barrels, different sizes, the subcompact, or the compact, no, subcompact, full size, and also the um, G40. So basically, if you want to watch Alaskan Ballistics, I'll link a card, but he's done dedicated comparisons between the three different sizes of Glock offerings, the 29, the 20, and the 40 and basically yeah he was really surprised with what the ballistics were on the 29 uh, versus the tw versus the 20 and the 40 so check that out for sure and basically that's what made me decide to go with this again 
Uh, I'm very happy with my purchase. So basically, I'm going to probably carry it this way for the summer for bear protection. And then come next late fall, I'll probably send it in. Uh, there's a couple local people here that do it, but have the slide milled and outfit it with a red dot since I'm much more comfortable with shooting with dots at this point than with irons and I just think it, it's a lot better and especially for how my eyes are and my age it's just just definitely the way to go so I was hoping that this summer Glock would release the Gen 5 10 millimeter line with an MOS but so far they have not so I eventually just decided to pull the trigger so to speak and grab this Gen 4 G29 at least for this summer. So that's my unboxing of my new G29. Hope you found this helpful and valuable. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. As always, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for joining me on the journey. LW Road, out.